Welcome CRE students! In this brief video, I will demo how to access and search some of the library's databases for your final assignment. First, you must begin your search process here at the library's homepage, astrayamountain.edu forward slash library. When accessing these resources from home, make sure to sign in with your MEID. During our searching in this video, it will not prompt you to sign in with your MEID because when searching from campus the connection is already authenticated. The resources you will be utilizing for your assignment are listed both in the Find Articles, Books, Ebooks, and Movies tab as well as under the right hand side of the library homepage Related Resources. The first database we'll explore is EBSCOhost Articles. Please click on EBSCOhost Articles. Providing access to thousands of full-text commercial scholarly resources, EBSCOhost databases cover a wide range of, range of subject topics. For this assignment, you can select General. If you are completing this assignment from school, this option should already, already be selected. Click Continue. Conduct an advanced search by selecting Advanced Search link under the search box. For your assignment, we're going to search for transgender individuals. By utilizing the Boolean operators AND, OR, or NOT, you can make your search very narrow or very broad. In this case, we're doing very um, specific. Limit your search to full text articles and scholarly peer review by selecting Full Text and Scholarly Peer Review under Limit 2 on the left hand side. When you find an article that you'd like to read, go ahead and select the title and scroll down to read the abstract. Articles will display in either Full Text, HTML, PDF Full Text, or both. To export this article, utilizing the tools on the right hand side, you can print the article by clicking the printer icon, email the article to yourself by clicking the envelope icon, you can export the citation of the article by downloading, by clicking the yellow um, cite page. or you can save the article by clicking on the floppy disk. The second database we'll explore is Academic OneFile plus General OneFile located under the Related Resources um, menu. This general database provides access to scholarly and commercial full text articles for our search, we'll try a basic search for transgender people. We can sort through the results using the menu to the left side to the to the right side of the screen. You can limit by subject by just selecting um, the subject topic, in this case transgender people. Articles are sorted by relevance or by age. By sorting by relevance, um, you're able to ensure that the frequency of your subject transgender appears at the very top of your search results. 
you can also limit your search by selecting more subjects by selecting the plus sign um, next to subjects you might consider adding the search subject of youth to ensure that you're searching transgender people and youth when you find a title that looks interesting select the title you have the option to download the full text of the article listen to the article by selecting the listening icon you can also utilizing tools on the right hand side of the, w of the page you can export a citation by selecting citation keeping tools. up with transgender youth you can email yourself the article by selecting email download and print you may highlight and make notes to your article if you've created a Gale Academic One file account. The third database we'll be exploring for your assignment under the Le Related Resources tab is Opposing Viewpoints. This database is designed specifically to highlight current research topics in the news. For our search, we'll try transgender people. using the basic search box at the very top of the screen. The design of the database sorts information into types. The first sections are authoritative reports with an overview of the main topic. Then there are viewpoints, which are essays written by authors for the database to provide multiple perspectives, pro and con, for a particular issue or aspect of the related search topic. The resources are then divided out by academic journals, statistics, news, audio, video, magazines, images, and references, which are um, book, uh, digital book chapters, as well as websites. When you select an information resource of interest, just click on the title. You have the option to listen to the article as well as cite, email, and download and print um, content. The fourth database I'd like to demo for you all is CQ Researcher or Congressional Quarterly. It is located on the left hand side of the library's homepage under Find Articles, Books, Ebooks, and Movies tab. Scrolling down to the section titled Controversial Issues, it is the second database, CQ Researcher. CQ Researcher offers a wide variety of authoritative and reliable reports by journalists on topics of current discussion within a U.S. context. The full-length articles include an overview, historical background, chronology, pro-con discussion, graphs, photos, and additional reading suggestions. Conducting a basic keyword search at the very top of the screen, we will search transgender. You'll notice that the date of the report is noted for currency of the research topic, as well as the lens or perspective of the, re of the report under the topic column. I'll pick the first article. To export this article via email or to print the whole report or sections, use the drop down menus at the very top of the article. The 
you may also select PDF to download the whole entire article to save to a USB drive. To navigate through the article, use the left hand side menu to jump through the sections of the report. If you have further questions, please visit a librarian here at the library in Estrella Hall or use our free Ask a Librarian 24-7 chat service for questions online. The portal is located here on the library's homepage. Happy searching!